guys and welcome back to another one of my videos. This one is actually the lovely Susie's debut on YouTube and we're going to create a set of nails on her today. So I'm going to use my CJP monomer. I use the ultra adhesive monomer. Then I'm also going to use in the core powder line, I'm going to use the birthday suit, snow white and then also crystal glass. For my glitters, I'm going to use this amazing glitter by Glitter Planet. It's called Bronze Me Up. Um, it's absolutely fantastic. It's like a rose gold with some purple flecks in it. And I love this. Then I'm also going to use the Diamond Glitters glitter. You can see it goes everywhere. It's the Light Pink Super Holographic number 4. The brush I'm going to use is the brush that I got with my Essential Nails kit. I um, love this brush. So first I'm going to go in with birthday suit and I'm just going to create a smile line on my pinky finger and then I am going to go to my ring finger and I attempted to do the rose quartz design, I don't know how to say that, um, kind of messed it up, I think I'll, I need a lot more practice on that one, um, I couldn't quite get the blending right. Then I'm going to go back to my pinky and I'm going to put in the white. Now, going forward, I will actually do the filing first because you can see this is a lot messy uh, and don't like it. Then on my ring finger, I'm going in with the holographic letter and I'm also just going to put some of that bronze me up down. My middle finger, I'm going to do like a ombreish look with the bronze me up going upwards. Then on my pointy finger, I'm going to do another smile line and then I'm going to put bronze me up down on my thumb I'm going to do again the rose quartz this one went a little bit better I got the mixture a bit better but to be honest I think I need some more practice then I'm just going to go and cap over the bronze me up just to seal that in nicely um, and then cap the rest of the nails now for me I think I need a lot more practice on capping because sometimes my capping is too bulky um, sometimes it's not I don't have enough on them, and then I just file the glitters away so a lot more practice needed on that like for instance on this nail if I didn't put enough on I would file half of the design away so that's the design done I am absolutely gutted because somehow I lost the video of the filing so I'm really sorry but I will do another one on the filing so all I'm going to do here is that I'm going to go in with a lint-free wipe and just clean off Susie's hand from all the dust and also remove all the dust from each nail so that there's none on there for when I want to actually do my top coats. So just cleaning them off nicely, making sure there's no dust. Then I'm going to go in with my Urban Graffiti top coat. Now I've used so many different top coats. I've got the Jellish top coat, I have the gel buffle companies one I also have the Kiara Sky maybe sometime I'll do a review on all of these so I've got different ones and I use them for different things so I'm gonna use my urban graffiti and I'm hoping you guys can actually see just how nice the nails turn out after you put the top coat on I think it is every single nail tech's favorite part of doing the nails is when you can actually add the top coats I'm going to try and zoom in enough on these so that you can see the glitter come through. You can't really see it on this one, but let's see if we can see it on this one. And as I move it, you can see just how amazing that glitter is. Then we're going to go on to, just a tad more, on to my pointy finger. And I loved the look on this one. Kind of see-through on the crystal glass. Then over to my thumb and I'm just going to top coat my thumb. Perfect. Perfect. Now again, I don't know how I managed to lose some of the footage, but I've done some of the crystals of the nails already, but I'll show you how I put the crystals on. So I've, I used the Kiara Sky um, base coat for my crystals to put them onto the nails. So I just pop the crystals in. The crystals that I'm using here is from Angel Crystals. I absolutely love them. Um, I use, I can't remember which ones they are, but I will link them down in the bottom for you. I will go have a look which ones exactly they were that I've used. Um, and just a little tip that I've learned. So when you put the crystals on the nail itself, they will move around. You need to just wipe off the nail properly. 
and as soon as one crystal touches the other they are stuck so <laughs> just a little tip there because I used to have them going all over the place and I loved this little design that I did on the thumb I'm an absolute sparkles lover and this was just an amazing little design I'm besotted with it just look at the sparkle 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 absolutely love doing this design it's amazing so there you go guys I hope you enjoyed this video if you did give us a subscribe and a thumbs up and make sure that you follow me on all of my social media more videos to come in the future love you guys lots bye